welcome back after my unsurprising or surprising amount of fun I had playing this game the last day I decided to have another round of it so I think today's objective was to have an all look in the destroyed space station or craft space station in the hope of finding a face hugger and uh, while I'm slightly distracted here it looks like this terraforming number on the top right is starting to go fairly fast which is good news I guess um, so what I need to do now is a food grower where's a food grower and why don't I have one yet They've been haters. I think I should probably set up the little computer screens and stuff in, in this place. I got a lump of iron. Well, maybe later. <clears throat> I'll do that once I get back. For now. Turn down the volume on this. For now, it's time to go and investigate the mysterious... Um, Mysterious base. Hold on out. I know money in the door. I see my water is running low. And I don't think I have. I do have some water. Alright, screw it. There's nothing in my inventory worth having at the moment, anyway, so. Oh, yeah. Right. Try and get as far in as I can. Taking everything. Well, I should deconstruct this. It'd be a lump of iron. I know what that is. I can't deconstruct the doors anyway. Jelly beans, good stuff. Water, more food. Now, while I'm here, I think it's. Ah, no, 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 I'll get another minute. Well, we have to leave now. <clears throat> Remember the way back's the hard part. Can I turn on the lights? Maybe I'll well drink the water too. I was thinking it may as well take everything from it so that way. The next time I come back, I don't get distracted by the same crates and stuff. Once I know they're empty, I'm all good. Well, I will need to bring some more oxygen next time. Although it's not really been the bit that's slowing me down. Oh, a new screen. Energy levels. Well, I'll start with the broad terraforming screen. That one gave me some good, good information. I liked having that one down. And. Sure, why not just have them all? I don't see myself returning to the other base for a while. Oh, yeah. Some 6% core towards the blue sky. Blueprints, energy levels. We're out of iron again. And um, can I build some more of these bios? No. The all uh, power supply getting noisy again. It doesn't seem to be fond of this game. CPU's only. I don't think I'm pushing it too hard, but whatever. Um, no iron in here anyway. I forget what I needed fabric for. It was something that popped up recently anyway that I needed it for. But I'll get by for now without it. Um, living grass. Oh, loads are going on. Communications antenna. Get chat with the boys back home. There's loads going on here. Need iron though. Plenty of iron. Uh, 
There's another bit there to me side. I'll just keep the ball rolling with the the, the plants for a minute. <clears throat> the fact that I keep getting so many of them in this uh, old spaceship. This will become my little botany zone. Alright, surely I got some bits there now. Ooh, ice. Why can't I just harvest some from here? Big fancy looking crystal in there, isn't it? I need a... I need a good reliable source of ice. But it's always kept outdoors. Unless there's some in this oddly placed chest. No, oh, just a bit of oxygen. Ooh. A golden crate. Golden effigy. My inventory is so full I can't use any of it anyway. I'll come back in a minute. Well, I built some chests because I have iron to do that. And then we'll go back and see what that gold chest has to offer. It was achievement worthy anyway. Um, and, 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 and. Let's cue. Might as well just build two. They won't go to waste. Right. Um, we'll keep the good bits in here for now. So I've got to figure out what a food grower is and how to make one. Right, oh wait. May as well empty everything out and just bring water bottle. There was an oxygen tank in the... Do I have another food pouch? Because it looks like I'm going to be hungry now in a minute. The thing I have to figure out is how to move stuff. I wonder do you lose more stamina and water when you sprint because I I'm clicking shift no matter where I go at the moment Ooh, a bigger oxygen tank and that's what we want but we'll take all the good stuff from here anyway I'm guessing that oh wait aluminium and super alloy I think it's a good idea just to destroy these help a lot in the long run well I don't think uh, there's a whole lot else on this I need more ice well there's plenty down here I just have to start wandering a little further afar I think I saw a piece here you see I also got to reserve some of this for drinking water I might have to just do a run in a minute and get loads of ice. Unless we figure out a way to like harvest it from deep underground or something. I'm kind of surprised the drills don't... Uh... Whoa. Eat, sunshine. May as well breathe as well. Well, there's fall damage. The plan the um gravity level on this planet is fairly normal. Don't say no to iron in there. I should really oh, I see like four pieces over here. This would be worth the walk. Cause ideally I want to build is the old gaff. The old digs. Ideally, I want to be building a couple of these food, uh, or not food things, the plant growers. Don't want to get too cocky either now and walk further away than I can handle. We're all out of ice. Alright, let's get back up quick because I'm halfway out. Half an empty tank. Up we go. I think I'll make it anyway. 
Well, I've got loads of ice. I'll probably be missing like silicone now or something else. So I'll deal with that in a minute. So I have, a, I have a bigger oxygen tank I can create now. I might as well do that too. It'll let me get a little further into that ship so I don't have to carry like two oxygen tanks then would do me for the, for the trip. All right. It's all the bob. Magnesium and silicone. Maybe if I start emptying this one. No magnesium or silicone in there. How many more silicones do I have lying around? Probably not enough. But I can build two. Yeah, two is all I can do for now. like that position uh, oh yeah I gotta keep an eye on energy consumption as well I'll take my big giant new plant uh, looks like we have another meteor shower something fancy that dropped this may be the game's way of restoring nearby resources doesn't look like it destroys your base anyway um so what else do i need for one last one magnesium silicone again because <coughs> what i was thinking i'll do here is i can i can take everything out of this actually i can what i can just do is deconstruct it and make a new one more ideal location. Actually, that's a few things now that I've made. Uh, what else can I make now? A new solar panel. Two bits for that. See transmissions for outer space. Use combination of transition transmission screen. Ooh, a window. But I kind of like an old window or two. I might make a few of them in a minute. Transmissions. A beacon. Hydration level low. That's alright. Um. Well, alright. I probably have a few of these things. Cobalt. That was one. Magnesium was another. Silicone and iron. Iron. <coughs> oh, we're all full. Iron. I don't think I have silicone though. Get all these jelly beans out. I could do a build in one of those uh, blueprint machines so I can sell the whatever those things are, the chips. Yeah, I need to go get some silicone. So well, let's see if the uh, fallen meteors brought down any gifts from above. Got our magnesium. More iron. At this stage, I think I just need to keep going around and picking up everything, because everything seems to be in hot demand for these next tiers of upgrades. Aluminum. I'm looking thirsty, actually. I want to head back to the old... Well, we need to head back. Need a drink some water. Well, maybe I should just go back inside. There's always chests full of stuff in here, anyway. If I just keep doing these loops and taking everything from every chest, it'll probably be faster and more interesting. Um, but I have enough to build a, a big solar panel. I suspect this one will build to a nice bit of electricity. Plus 19. Oh, yeah, that's a good bit more. Do I have water? I do. Alright, let's craft the bigger... 
I'll build this too. I was thinking I'd build a bigger oxygen tank. We'll get rid of these anyway. Compass. That's it. One new blueprint. Right, we're 12 weight, 12% 12 towards having blue skies. We have a bit of green in me. And we have enough power to do us for a little bit. Beacon helps you find. Yeah, that, that would be ideal actually at the moment. But anyway, let's dump a load of this stuff in. Oh, yeah, look, I still have a, the blueprint microchip. Why is it not let me? Oh, yeah, there we go. Mining speed T2. Oh yeah, that's what I needed to make. Um, did I make one already? Nope. Iron and silicone. Well, I know I don't have silicone. If I want the next tier of my oxygen tank, I have to build it through one of those things. I could run back to the other base and just gather a load of crap on the way. That feels like regression. Well, I'll just keep running. If I die, I die. Until I find enough pieces of silicone. There's one piece. Looks like one bit there. No, it's iron. No, it's silicone. Titanium's not been all that useful at the moment, is it? There's another lump of ice. I do need water. The silicone is not... Not have been a bountiful run for silicone, has it? I'm going to struggle to make it back. There's two pieces. Right, I'll chance my luck. Full speed run. This is going to be uh, risky. I wonder where I'll respawn actually now that I'm. Um, now that I have a new digs. Oh, I know it's low. Is that iron? Yeah. Come on! Oh, this is dangerous. A double bed. Ooh. I don't want any more close runs like that one now. Right, what was I going to build? Completely lost track of everything. One of these lads. Right. Bigger oxygen tank. Do I have a bigger backpack? I think I probably have it equipped already. Yeah. Oh, and I got the food grower. Right, uh, aluminium's all I need. <clears throat> and to unequip. Whoa, didn't mean to do that one. Well, now I find myself in a bit of a jam, don't I? Do I still have enough? Yes. This I want to do on the cliff. Guess it's two eighty. Not huge amount of increase, but sure look we'll take what we can get. Right, what do we got here? Better mining speed. We may as well get the tier two. Oh we have to have tier one anyway. We need some aluminium. Compass. Could do a build in both of those. Increase movement speed. Do I have agility boots yet? No. And movement speed's been a problem. Oh, that's probably where the fabric came from. Don't know if I have enough aluminium though, because I do want the the mining speed thing too, which is aluminium super alloy. Right, I need three aluminium. Is that one? It looks an awful lot like ice. Oh, we just have enough. Just enough. Get 
them boys equipped. And the last one, this fella. The super ally floating around somewhere. Right, now that's good news. Now we're talking business. Alright, let's empty everything out. Uh, well, I need to build some water. With all the ice I have. And food. I'll take that extra one because I need to eat now. And what was the last thing I need? Oxygen. What do you make oxygen from again? Cobalt. I've not needed them for a while. Alright, that should be enough. Wait, make sure I've got no... Yeah, I'm all good. Don't need that much food, do I? I could get hungry that easy. Now, time for the second raid. This time I'm going to be far more aggressive in what I steal. be sure lumps of iron but right, iron is valuable the catch here now is that oh, I needed aluminium the catch here is if I go too deep I gotta consider the time it takes to get back out Can I just take... Can't destroy it. Ooh. Fusion reactor. Well, I'm guessing that's going to bring power back to this base. If I can figure out... Oh, maybe uranium. Now, that's a little crude, but... What else could go in there? I don't think... It... Well, I'd probably progress further and get some sort of refined source of uranium. Alright, well that's it. The, the ship had less secrets than I had hoped. But there's lots of doors, so you know, power that reactor with something. I'll try uranium. That was actually a good run. I didn't even need to use my oxygen. I'm back to the calf. Need a few windows on this fella anyway. Right. Let's make a food pod. We're all full up, full up here. We're going to need an extension soon. Alright, jelly beans. Vegetables in space. Let's take this uranium. you back and some jelly beans let's throw them in and see what happens we'll leave it a while hey anyway, while I have time let's get back and see if the uranium does anything I can't see what other a reactor like that would surely use uranium but we'll see if it needs to be refined if I have to build some sort of refiner for it I feel like I harvested that chest a second ago. But I guess not. Now, do you. I did, yeah. Well, I guess we found an infinite source of iron. Doesn't seem to want to accept. Doesn't want to accept their uranium just yet. We'll see what the messages have to say. Oh, that's a big old message to read. We're going to try and make an emergency land in the summer for our planet. See what there is. Something drained the ship's power. Spooky. Okay, well, we'll hold on to that uranium for a while. I'm sure it can be refined. Oh, no. He's off again. 
I'm sure it can be refined later on into something... Something more... Like a power core. But until then... There's nothing left in here to be... Discovering. But this will start melting soon anyway. We're not... I don't think we're that far off uh, Blue Sky. 20% there. And it's accelerated quite a lot faster than it had a while ago. Um, tools will build it, will we? This is the big lad. I don't want to. I don't want to go too heavy on the building on here because this is going to be where I expand to later on. I won't waste time on it at the moment. All right, that's forever blocked by the wall. No, this one's blocked by the soil. Man, that's a little off center. Maybe then I can make a nice little window. Oh, no cobalt. I was on a window here because if I obviously can't go any further out, we may as well make a window out of it. Add a bit of colour from the outdoors. I'm sure the outdoor will be getting more attractive soon once the... The outdoors will start getting a bit more attractive now when we have blue skies and stuff. This makes it feel a little less claustrophobic in here. We want, uh, we want some green. Now, what are these things doing again? These are providing... Oxygen. So, what's going a bit slow? Heat's not going very fast. Oxygen is absolutely bombing it. Got enough plants here now to go go for a few a few days. He's growing nicely too. Growth speed. It doesn't do anything other than consume a lot of uh, resources. Hmm. A lot to go into that bed. Alright, let's make a heater, another heater. Looks like we're a bit slow on that one. No, I need titanium. It's been everywhere a while ago, but I haven't been picking it up now. These are kind of bulky yolks to be, you know, filling your base up with though. Put it in like that for a moment. I may as well do a quick save. Heat's going up a tad faster now. Yeah, percentages are rising. What I can really just do is leave the game alone for a while. Let's go back, go for a snooze. No. Don't do that. Um sure when to build another drill. They're easy make. I don't think they were doing much harm, although they did use power. But they were making... making uh, yo -ho! And we've stalled. Cobalt, cobalt, and aluminium. I don't think we have any of these things. That's not good, is it? Well, I can make one more with normal cobalt. What does this little fella need? Oh, just a lump of iron. Well, we can probably make one of them nice and handy. No shortage of iron. It's silicone on our doorstep this whole time. Now, what did I need? Aluminium? I could destroy something that has aluminium. I thought if the low level one had aluminium, I could just recycle it. Oh, fuck my neck. Oh well, lump of cobalt. I see some over here. Another solar panel should do the job. 
Now it's 175,000, 175 KTI till I get blue sky, but it looks like that ice said it would start melting a little sooner than that. Power is restored. Now we're f we're speeding up the numbers. That drill has done a little bit more towards pressure and heat. Not a whole lot, but whatever. We'll be happy with what we got. That's potential window window material there too. Iron and cobalt again. I need somewhere else to go. I've kind of got myself in the corner now. Let's just get it in T2. I don't need that just yet. Maybe I'll just gather everything at the moment. I know the windows aren't really doing anything, but I like them. I like the view. No. Silicon. Hydration's low. Did I bring water with me? I did. I'll have a sip. Yeah, I need to start spreading further or far. Well, do you know what I'll do? I'll just start building um, little checkpoint bases almost where I can get my oxygen back. And maybe with a chest or two or something like that. Like, I'm going to need to start exploring here anyway, so let's just build the little uh, the little pit stop. Build it down in the hole. Oh, iron. So at least that's giving me my, my oxygen back each time. Slightly wasteful, I know. Don't die too easy from the the thirst and the hunger. Yeah, I might have to head back to my original spot. <coughs> Depends on how quickly I can get the terraform and go on. If I can speed it up a bit, I should be alright. But yeah, it's going quick enough. Get the ice. So I can build another one of those oxygen makers. Inventory's full. Fair enough. Back to the big spot in the hill. Oh, I know. I was thinking in my head there a minute ago. I was like, well, what stops me from just building loads and loads of um, the, the greenhouse things and using oxygen? Because the terraform index doesn't seem to be capped. Like It just seems like oxygen's making up the most of it at the moment. I don't remember if the sky always looked this color, but it's getting a bit more fancy looking. But anyway, um, yeah, I was thinking, what stops me from just maxing out oxygen? But then you get the upgrades for uh, different tiers. So if you if you focus more on pressure, you'll get other unlocks here. What do I really need? Better drill, biogen, veggie tube, better heater. Like, there's a good few bits. Nuclear reactor. So here we go. Let's get the pressure up. Up to 60. We've got a ways to go with that one. Um, well then I need a better drill. Where is it here? It's drill 4. Heat. I'm not far off the next tier of the drill. I suppose you can destroy the old ones. Uh, anything new? The exoskeleton. I don't really need it at the moment. Because there's nothing new to be, to be building. Right, what else have I built recently? Nothing either. Okay, well, let's make another drill, so. Throw a couple of these off the side-ish. I don't know. Not far I want to build out this way, but I know it's dead in here, so. Oh, wait, power. Keep forgetting power is an issue. I'm still, again, stuck for aluminium. Out of 
iron again. That means I can't build another drill. That looks like it could be, you know, it's probably all connected to the one thing. Once the power is restored, the door will open then. Oh, there's loads of iron here. Yeah, right click to build. I build it on the edge of the mountain. Uh, oh no. Oh, didn't mean to do that one. One else is stuck outside. A bit like a dong. Oh, here we go. I picked it back up. So a little table here then, looking outside would be cool. It's not needed for the moment. Um, yeah, I'll make another drill. Get the pressure going a bit faster. And a little bit of heat. Although, actually, I could probably... I'll probably make another heater. And make another room. No, titanium. Surely I have some of that. I'll build a couple of bit of a couple of an expansion blocks here. I think uh Yeah, maybe I should grow out there a bit. I can't extend here. We are in trouble. Well, we're not really. I'll just put a door here. Start going upstairs. Now, we've got a back door. The back door that can... I feel like I just make this one too. Hard to get us upstairs. Hey. Now, can I make another room on top of it? Because if I can start doing that, then I can just go wild. Yep. Perfect. Alright, give me all my... All my iron and titanium and we'll start expanding a bit. But I'll, I'll go four. Four is enough for now. If I have four pieces of titanium to work with. No. Okay, we're, we're limited again. What's a heater need? Aluminium and silicone. I don't think aluminium is grown on trees at the moment. Nope. What's a... Uh, Food grower. More silicone. I'll build another one of them, so. Just because that seems to be getting the terraforming going nice and quick. Oh, I could be the two. Yeah, like the oxygen one's going nice and fast. Um, maybe one more before I go. I don't think I have enough silicone left. I definitely have ice. But I'm pretty sure I'm all out of silicone. Yeah, I am. Alright. Oh, it's full. Bring some food. Do you know what? I'll probably just eat some food now. This that's turned into a big juicy lad. Well, I'm halfway towards having the next place unlocked. Oh, that looks like something over there. We need faster boots. Hmm. Ooh, and something else over there. Some sort of a ring. We need a teleporter now. Get me places faster. Because we've gone and maxed out what was in... But I'm pretty much maxed out what was in the... whole spaceship thing here. Okay. Nothing I can do. 
We've, we're done with here for now. So I'm going to head back to the old base. And I'll gather some crap along the way. Might build another heater or two. No, I won't. Because I left all the red stuff behind. But I'll find some more. Maybe. I'll gather a bit of air in here. Not that I really need it. I think this bigger tank, even though it's only 180, 280, it seems to be uh, empty and a lot slower. Alright, never mind all of these now. Silicone ice. They're the boys that are letting me down. And aluminium, but that doesn't seem to be obtainable outside of ruined structures. The ice is only handy because it gives me a means to build the greenhouse things. And this is Silicon Valley here. I didn't ne didn't harvest nearly enough stuff from this area. Starting to look a bit bit rough. And we're full. Well, lads, I'm home. Back to the old digs. I could use the money I had, or not money, but the resources I have here to build. God, do I have veggie tube? Do I have aluminium here? I do. Let's build a better power generator because if it's shared across the whole planet anyway it'll eventually be of use I have more here all right what else can I build that high end the bigger veggie tubes good all right do I have two iridium to get the all heat and going a bit better I've got one new no. could build one of these this should where does this need to go? Outside? It's an outdoor veggie tube. Let's take the plant out of this one. Because this is only a tier 1. So this is probably going to give me a whole lot of oxygen anyway. 13. I don't know what that one gave, but... Not 13. Right, we're getting up the, up the ranks a bit quicker here. Um, 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 yeah, nothing else new here. But I've used up my aluminium. What I'll do is I'll start uh, working my way towards whatever was going on over the hill because there was definitely some cool stuff over there. No, I need some water. Just make one or two more while I'm here. So yeah, I built a little hut in the hill up here. I won't take anything for the moment because who knows what goodies I'll find over the cliff edge. But it was looking like a... Ooh, something's up in the hill there. It was looking like there was a crashed ship. Yeah. That's something to investigate, isn't it? I'll see how far I can get with maybe like half a tank of oxygen. And once I get half empty, then that's when I'll build a little settlement. They're all just little checkpoint areas anyway. You know what? I might not go so close to this though because I want to see what that big circle thing is over there. Like a big relay dish thing. This will do. Ooh, titanium. There we go. Now, the good thing that this ship might have is some um, iridium. Well, they seem to have the rare things that don't... That aren't just littered around the map normally. Oh, there's a big cave over there. Well, isn't this a very luxurious ship? I guess this was a big glass window at one stage in its life. Shockingly familiar to the other ship we were in. Oh, 
Radioactive symbols. Loads of plants. Yeah, always need them. And my idea of destroying the chest is probably pointless at the moment. Now that I now that I know they respawn. How am I meant to get past that? Oh yeah, never mind. Not sure if I brought uh I'll take the aluminium. Alright, fucking about halfway now and it's getting risky. It's a big heater. Do I have enough space in the inventory? I do not. Well I'm coming back here in a minute though. Well I'll just build a little heater in this new little forward base I've got going on here. I might build an old chest or two. This will turn into a nice handy camp 2.0. Close enough to the caves over there to see what's going on. Close enough to that other thing over there. Whatever it is. So I'll build a few bits. Alright, chests for starters. Just to get the good stuff out. Plants are valuable. Maybe I'll just build one more. But the good news is I'll definitely get enough to build a big heater because there was a big heater there that I can just de deconstruct and bring back with me. That heat we need to get more unlocks. The ship's in remarkably good condition. be a load of stuff in there now and it was I'll put the iron back in favor of the aluminium there was a uh, was there more here no that was everything anyway Ooh, one more plant get rid of the titanium in favor of the plant Iron and titanium, cobalt, they're all your bog standard resources. Need a bigger backpack anyway. You're holding out for that one to start coming. It seems weird that this place needs heat. It looks pretty damn hot already. The charred ground. Looks like there was water here at one stage. I wonder, will it return? Have I built a base in a. Well, my one up the top of the hill is in a hot spot, so. Because that's not going to be an issue. Oh, I need to build inside. I forgot about that. Heat. Can I have enough to build one more of these? That's magnesium and silicone. Magnesium. No silicone. None to be seen. One silicone. We need two. There's probably loads around here. Um, silicone. Two silicones, magnesium, aluminium. So two silicones and magnesium. I get plenty of uh, aluminium in the thing. And I'll build a couple of greenhouses. I am quite curious to see what's behind the ice over there. do feel the urge to run back once I get to 100k, but I'll get the blue sky thing first. And that should give me the time I need then to just uh, sift around the place, see what's going on around here. Mm. Alright, a couple of outdoor growers, so... Should have a oh yeah, aluminium and water bottles and the ice. Oh crap, I can't build water bottles here. Well I'll have to build a little water bottle builder, won't I? Whatever that requires. We're gonna need an expansion. Loot 
titanium. Right, that's another one down. And we still have the better drill. Right, iron. Surely I have a piece of that. I'll build three to start with. Oh, shoot, we out of power. What do we need here? Build another big one anyway. Cobalt, silicone, and iron. So, iron. Cobalt. Might use this as an opportunity to build several power generators. When are we going to go nuclear? The terraformers hit a, a roadblock. Still need silicone, no. End the supply at this stage. Everything seems to be based on it and it looks awful similar to iron so when you're kind of scooting across the landscape it's easy to miss it there we go that's a bit of a jackpot there no all right we're full up i'm surprised at this stage now that when it comes to power generation there was no consideration for wires surely there'll be something we need I have enough to build another one. I do. Right, let's get three plants out of here. I want to see what this one is. We'll go three diverse ones. Actually, does the plant produce different... 19, 26? They do. Those little grassy ones aren't great. These green ones are where these blue ones are where the magic that. Oh, look at the speed of the terraforming now. Oh, look, let's not do things for aesthetic purposes. It was nearly double. And yeah, can I build another power thing while I've got the? The goodies out here, cobalt and aluminium. Oh, I've used up all my aluminium. Alright, well let's uh let's offload a bit of stuff and go adventuring again. Oh, I'm getting hungry though. Let's do a save. Right, uh there's a good possibility now we'll see the 175 before I know it. What I could do here is because I don't have a whole lot in my inventory, go on a bit of a, a kamikaze run here. And I'll just keep going and going until I've got nothing left. Just to see whether um, this thing in the distance is even worth seeing. Might be fairly pointless, like. So we'll see what it is and if it's a structure worth saving. I might be able to quickly gather enough nearby resources. This place is cool anyway. This is where the zombie skeletons totally gonna hang out. But you know what I won't I won't take anything good. In case I don't survive. And I'm sort of lost my direction a bit. I wonder, I must check the game settings and see is there a way, is there a draw distance setting? And presumably it's uh, gone and scans my system and has it determined that this is the best draw distance I can have, but what we're getting 
It looks like a solid 60 frames per second. I could sacrifice that. If we went down to 50. If it meant a better draw distance. But it just seemed better at night time. Or daytime. We're almost here anyway. Ooh. Toxic red looking gas. We don't know if it's toxic yet. I'll grab us another piece of iron. Because I know those are the building blocks of... An emergency settlement. So, yeah, there's something here, alright. But let's just... Iron, titanium. May as well hold out and go investigate a little further. This is the best I'm getting for now. Right. Oh, we need another piece of iron. Ponto. I do have an oxygen tank with me that I could have used. But I'm being a tight ass. Right, over here and let's see what's going on. It looks like there's so something over there. It looks almost looked like the same kind of structures I can build. We may find a friend. A space friend. Alright. I've not got a blueprint in a while. They've been a bit stingy with the all blueprints. We're stuck in eternal darkness again. Doesn't look like there's anything here though. So if I die, I die. Hmm. Yeah, here we go. This does look like it an entry an entrance. With or without power. Oh, we can go in. More uranium. Don't take anything yet. Wanna get a, a feel of the place first. Although in saying that now, I could probably do quite well if I have enough. There's another, I'm pretty sure I saw titanium in. I saw titanium a minute ago. Just one piece, and I think a silicone was needed too. I might just build a little base outside the front door of this so I can quickly scavenge it. Get a chest. Essential. Which way do I want to expand? We'll, we'll make it like this. I'll, I'll stick to a, a new routine. Right, back in. Steal everything. A new heater. I'm just going to take everything. I mean, nothing left. Then I can see what I can build outside. Right, we're looking like we're close to uh, blue skies. We're not far away. 131. What's this take? Iridium rod. That again looks like we're going to have to start doing some manufacturing. I mean, maybe that's why you don't want to get too far ahead, so in any particular. Titaniums and aluminiums. The energy consumption is probably going to be high from that, though. Minus 17. Really, what one of these produces? 
Do I have two cobalt? I go out and get two cobalt. The uh oh, we're full up. Now, the skies are looking bluer anyway. That's starting to look blue to me. Gone very deserty. And that's plenty of power. So I can try and make the next drill. More aluminium, iron and titanium. I should probably get the those supplies in there. we got the uranium find myself ever need more oh okay I don't know if there's gonna be more in there but I will be keeping my eyes open for anything that looks like a power source a removable power source come on More aluminium. The hot supply. There's only certain thing. Oh, a heater. That's only a tier two one, but I, I don't have iridium rods yet. Right, out we go again. But yes, building another heater would. Because I can't. I don't know what the rods are and how to make them. Does use aluminium though. Hold on, I think I might have left some behind. I did. Let's build the new heater. Or not the new heater, the new drill. Just thinking in case like this is what produces. Why can't I make it now? It was let me build it a second ago. I got too picky about lo location. Does a tooltip might give you a suggestion? Trapped in the ground. So I'm guessing it needs to be on certain type of ground. Don't be too four. Oh, hey! It's still there now while it's working. Can't see the stats. All right. Really heat. A lot of pressure. Hungry on the all energy consumption. I'm going to have a lot of good stuff to bring back to the main base. Too much good stuff that I probably won't be able to make my mind up of what to keep and what to throw away. I'm going to have to start thinking about uh, the basics of survival soon too. I'm going to have to find more food. All of them seem to have a little message board anyway. Lots of these microchips. Today was an original space warp gate. It took two years to build it. And finally, we'll be able to easily cross. Oh. Main power reactor, everything went wrong. Power immediately went down. All the reactors. The stabilizer is broken. In a few minutes, the spaceship was inexplicably drawn to the closest planet we trapped. So that might have been what made the other ship crash. That's cool. Bit of a story, I suppose, isn't it? Oh yeah, look. Still no, uh... This doesn't have a power source either, though. I can't destroy it yet. Uh, take a screenshot of that one for later. Okay, I think, uh... This place has been picked. Ooh. Now well, that's new. I spoke too soon. Clearly not picked completely dry. 
Right, let's get back into the other place again and uh, empty my inventory. We're sure as hell going investigating that cave. But what I was thinking of doing was... Because I just have so many... Um, advanced crafting station. I have so many of these microchips now that I really just got to get rid of them. I can destroy it in a minute. Okay, we got blue skies. I don't see what that's done to change things, but... It was a, mom a monumental event. Right, I do need to expand, though. This is, uh... This base has gotten too small. Where's the titanium? There's one piece. So I think for the new layout of these, I'm going to go like a T-shape. So that way I can always get by with my little lobby lobby area first. They look like all iron. How far can we go with the terraform? What's the number? Is the limit? Or have I hit it? We'll get a few more bits of titanium to grow slightly. But I am... I do want to return to that area that had the ice. But then again... I think it's just because the first first place that piqued my interest. But it looks like we have some interesting stuff nearby now. That's enough for now. Well, we're looking at the big old space gate now. Whether that can be repaired. Eagerly finding out what the power source is all about. I may as well build a little base here too because I have a feeling now I'm going to eventually need to do something cool here. Which is the extra power sources. I won't go too heavily for the moment. What I'll do. Well, I suppose I can destroy what I don't need to take it with me. And that's what you'll do. So yeah, I'll go in a T shape then from here. Anyway, crafting station. I do need that for more water. I have ice, though. Faster mining speed. No bigger backpacks yet, though. Faster boots. But I don't have super alloys. Not many of them, anyway. I might have one. Yeah, just one. Not enough. We do need another chest. Expert hoarder. Right, ice. Before I die of thirst. If I pick the wrong area to find ice. And it's mad how you might quickly find yourself without the basics of survival. The food goes down slow. I think I might have picked up some food packs inside there, so I should be alright, but I ain't seen any feckin' water around here. This is getting the all heart rate up now. I drank my last bit of water. And I'm about to die of thirst. Ooh. Could that be because I've gotten the, the temperature of the planet too high? Ah, look, if I die, I die. I'll respawn back somewhere. I've nothing in there to lose. I, yeah, I don't think I'll use stuff that's, like, equipment-wise. Alright, this place is barren. That almost looks like a glitch out there. There's nothing compared to the rest of the world. Well, let's not go that way. Let's see how I can, far I can go, so I might find ice in a chest or something. If I am going to die out here, let's at least see what goes on in the little tunnel. 
There was nothing worth having in this base at the moment anyway. A couple of plants of this, but like... Nothing uh, out of the ordinary. Oh, all that for a chest. So a bit more food. Will food help hydration? Nope. I do have that second um, magic thing, whatever, special alloy. I forget what I needed to build with it now, but this is troubling. something in here. Oh wait, it was the extra boots. Speedy boots. Oh, well, I probably don't have enough fabric, do I? No. Just my luck. Grass spreader. This means we can start growing grass. Is this a spot to do it? I think not. It's another blueprint down anyway. Well, look, I'll run out quick and see. Maybe back towards where the other base was. I'll run back towards there. I might find ice along the way. But I think it could be gone. Which then brings forward the question, how do I... Grows grass outside, generates biomass. Craft new advanced tools and blueprints. Nothing here that can... Be like a water synthesizer. But grass seems like a, a step in a good direction, doesn't it? I do quite like the idea of having to um, turn the desert into a bit of an oasis. But yeah, we're in a jam now. I don't think it's left me much of a choice. I'll have to return to where the old base was. I'll have some ice in the chest there to at least survive until I can grow some grass. Unless that area that had the glacier, that's kind of developed into a river. It said it would start melting at 100, so we're well beyond that now. Hmm. We'll see. Let's go. Where am I? I've definitely gone the wrong way now. I actually went down the hill. I can't afford to be wasting time like this. But no, there's not a, a block of ice to be seen. And you know, I haven't seen one in a while either. I would usually be picking at these as I go along. Well, look, the next HQ base is just over here. So there might have been water here. Or maybe it appears at night time. That looks like a piece over there. Not all over, is it? Just one. And a golden chest. I'll come back for it, just in case I die. Ah, no, actually, hydration level doesn't fall that fast. Ooh, and the iridium rods. Save that for later, too. Now... Now is the pressure time. Right, that's plenty of ice. That's two, um, two things. Right, this is obviously the chilly area. This is where it gets a bit nippy. Which is actually better. Get back with the oxygen. Didn't even think of that. Not sure how far away I am now. Oh, this could go wrong. Oh, well, actually, I think I have an oxygen can on me. The, the uh, water doesn't go down that fast. And I'm pretty sure I built a synthesizer here for the water. Well, this is a cool little desert area, too. I might just turn this into my little oasis. I felt a little too far away from comfort zone. That other base, anyway. Well, that's something, isn't it? 
condensed iridium rod. Another effigy. There's a witty rocket. Oh, damn. Okay. Well, can we build another storage crate? No. Alright, what's next on the build list? There's loads of bits to build now. I want the grass grower. But we need... We need lots of stuff. I think I'm going to return up here. I'm curious to see what's behind the glacier and... Well... Yeah, I will, I will. I will. But what I might do first... Actually, do I have enough... Um, yeah, I do. Magnesium, and I'm pretty sure I had one of those grass things a minute ago, because I didn't use it in the the green zone. So this can be my little green lab. It's a nice open area, too. I'm sure I would have left it in the chest. Alright. That's it. Oh, hold on. What's missing? Water ball. Nice, reasonably big radius. Now, whoa, this means a lot of oxygen. Energy plants. It doesn't doesn't give me uh, doesn't give me any water though. Well, I'll just do a quick look. There was ice here anyway. So no, that answers the other question of has the terraforming caused the ice to melt? Not entirely. Well, there's a good bit around here. I'll harvest a few bits, save some back at the base for emergencies. And by the time I get back there might have been a bit of grass growing so we can see what that looks like. But the oxygen situation should be very high at the moment. Like loads. And I have the iridium rod to build the next here heater. The aluminium has been the the thorn in my side. Oh, there's a big ship over there too. Alright, this definitely is gonna become the, the new hotspot, so. Maybe I'll go back over there later. I know it's in walking distance now. Yeah, it's getting somewhere, isn't it? Can build a few of these around the area and make it a little utopia. Do I have any iron? No. I haven't been picking up enough. So yeah, I'm just going to go back to the original base for a minute. Just to see what's going on with the that frozen glacier thing. And then that's actually iron. Inventory full? Oh yeah, full of ice. Right, I can drop some jelly beans. This is looking nice though, isn't it? Definitely gonna need windows in this place. But you could stack the chest a bit. Right, and have tons of water in here. I'm already maxed out. I might bring one of them plants back. I should look, I'll bring some water back to the other place too. Right, we're ready. Run! As far as we're going, 47%. That's good. Don't think grass produces that much oxygen in reality though. But we need a better way to gather water. Unless there's going to be a river here, it would make sense that the glacier would produce a nice little river. Now that it's melted. Well, I could 
just don't have enough aluminium, so never mind. I'll check all the chests though near just in case they have some. Even good ice behind there. Now these ones have been picked dry of the good stuff. Yeah, there was that other ruin in that little valley over there. There's stuff everywhere. I need a bike or a car, a little buggy. A little rover. See if that comes back. There's a interesting shape rock with a thing growing on it. Well, I'll leave this base as it is. Well, although, now that I think about it, the some of them growing pods is that would just be an inefficient use of power. Wouldn't I be better shutting them down, taking their resources and building the more advanced ones? I'll double check, but I don't think actually they share enough resources. But we'll see. That ain't looking very melted to me. Um, magnesium, silicon, iron. Magnesium, silicon, iron. Yeah, pretty much. Could destroy them. In favor of them. Whoa, what's that? 1.8. That's not a whole lot, is it? 2.4. Oh, right. Because the outdoor ones, they were using like 30. Well, then, absolutely, let's destroy these. And outside instead. Let's build a better one. Whoa, we're out of resources. Aluminium and silicone. Sure. Aren't I forever shooting himself in the foot? Oh well. Now let's go and see what's going on here. It said told me 100k. Oh, NK. What's the N stand for? Because I would think that M would come next. A launch platform. Yeah, I would have assumed that the M would be the next. If we're at Kilo now, we'll be at Mega TIs, whatever that stands for. What does the N stand for? It doesn't stand for anything. Because it's M, G, T. What comes after terabytes? I don't know. In my lifetime, we're getting hard drives that big. Right, back to the other base, so, and we'll, uh, I got my eyes on the, the wreck in the distance. But we've got clouds, that's, uh, something promising, isn't it? I liked where this base was going. The origin story. I'll take the good stuff, I suppose. Don't have any, uh, food pods in the... The new digs. Alright, let's get over there, so. And we're going to have to do some big expansions. I'll grab all the iron and silicone, or I'll iron and titanium I can on the way. Um, build some good expansions here now. Because this is going to become the new place. Well, as I hope the music starts getting a bit happier as the, the planet improves. It feels just like atmospheric space music now. Alright, we're full up. I want to start playing like Jungle Book music and stuff soon when it starts getting really happy. Right, there's a good bit of silicone there, I'll have to remember that. This lad is doing a great old job. It's 100% grown. So 108, that's a lot. Right, let's expand. Wait, 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 wait. Well, I'll build one more anyway, because I have to... But... This looks like it's going to be maybe a more decorative... More decorative way to go about it. 
Why aren't you letting me? Is it because of the rock? Oh, hydration's low. We'll get rid of that. Hey, that's gonna look nice now. It's already got a bit of blue going on. And I think in upstairs it'll be necessary very soon. This is cool looking. Okay, one more maybe out that direction and then a and then a door. And that'll be big enough. I don't want to be sprawling out too far. I'd rather build up than out. go a little bit bigger. I'll regret it in the future. Being so tight with space. I could cost that much. Well it does now because I'm full up. I need iron. But I like the look of this place. Surely I have one iron in here. But I got aluminium. There we go. Although this is full, so. Although if I use this iron, then I won't be able to build another door. Bah. Okay. One last bit of iron and I'll build the door. And that'll be my quick way in and out of this building. His iron's always been so plentiful. When you need it, then it's vanished. I'm a big fan of the um, those glassy curves, though. Can I build another one? I might do. Let's do another one here. There we go. Now it's a very one more box in the middle here then and the the shape will be complete. Two iron. That's a big chunk of ice. Oh and a chest. Hidden down in the hill see what's in it. There's always a bit of iron, isn't there? Whoa, it's a big one. We'll take the iron anyway. Stop right there. Oh! It's starting to rain. As long as it's clean rain. But yes, now we have a Pretty big looking base. Let's see what's going on here. Is this another makings of some more mystery? There's another chest. I picked a bad time to find it when my pockets are full. Take the uranium. I'll throw the ice in for now. Uranium is getting a little bit plentiful now. Wonder what this will start doing to the soil. Will it make things start growing organically now? And in turn it'll just start like a... A positive feedback loop. Magnesium, you're going to have to go... Aluminium's rare. This is pretty cool, though. I might build another block or two on. Although, actually... Hey, nuclear reactor! 
Well, that's surely where... Uh, oh, uranium rod. Probably should build one of them. The magnet, whatever that thing was. The advanced desk. One more trunk. Take that back. Say that one for later. Um, what was it in here? That's one more magnesium. This looks like it. I build it here in front of my window. Oh, it's a big lad. I guess we'll go here, so. I need straight. That does look better. Oh, that was a big noise. Ran out of power. Shoot. Iron, cobalt, cobalt, silicone. There was silicone over here a minute ago. Lots of titanium and no iron. Silicone and iron now. Silicone, where are you? Good. Top of my titties. Looking very, uh, very, very positive looking environment now. Food level low. That's something I probably should take into a bit of tension at the moment now, is food. Hopefully this gives me enough. No! Level 2. More silicone and cobalt. What was in the chest down here? Continuously been a hard one to find. That's some. Right, surely two little solar panels will do the job. Till I get my uranium rod. And we're back to life. Um. This one time I do have enough iron to make another chest. Although, maybe I shouldn't build too much just yet. Until I know what I can do here. Oh, here we go. Extremely condensed uranium. Bigger backpack. I could probably build a bigger backpack now. Ooh. And a jetpack. Two rocket engines. Oh, I need a lot of these super alloys. Oh, I can make them. A bit of everything. I surely have three of them here, though. The backpack's been. The backpack's been getting me. I got one. Alright, we got none. But it's okay for now. Um, I will actually bring one silicone, I need two, three iron, use that one up on the little computer here, wherever I left it. Oh, I never built one. 
Never mind. I'll do that later. Alright, that's enough to build a little... Uh, a little oxygen restoration place. No, it's probably a waste now that I think about it. I could have... Uh, could have brought some. Right, picked the wrong time to... Run out of hydration. That's a big ass looking ship over there. But the caves first. But whatever this is. This is like volcanic ash. The lighting looks quite good here. Alright, I see red things floating around now. I don't know what they are. Little lava balls. Aha. Alright. Useful ish, I guess. I don't need a whole lot of that right now, especially when I just found the rod in uh whatever you call it. That gold chest a minute ago. So I can probably let this one go. And I might just run back to the base for a second then. Get more water. But actually, you know what? Let's just build a little outward base, so because I'm gonna need one anyway. So let's just use this as a chance to. This big ship was the goal anyway. I'd imagine I get quite a bit of uh, aluminium at least. Right, let's let's use this as the spot. Well, do you know what? I could get further because. My tank was fine. I'll build it up here where it's uh, visible on the hill anyway. Hydration levels critical. I got water. Right, back to the ship. Well, it's good I got... Oh, you know what? I should have... Um I should have actually built it close to this, so that way I could have just ran in and out the way I kept did it a minute ago with a load of little pit stops. <coughs> I need three iron, one silicone, and two titanium. And I might just build another one here. I think I just need one more titanium. Wow, this place is scattered with big bits and bobs. We'll find a way in. And that's where we'll hunker down. That looks like the way in to me. So I probably need to build a bunch of chests and then I can like take the good stuff. Leave any junk behind. Alright, let's go in so and see what this this place is about. I wish it wasn't night time. How am I meant to get in? This is a far bigger ship anyway. But I bet you if I had a uranium rod we could turn this uh we could turn this fella back on. Do you know I wonder if I put the uranium rod into one of these with that power Add to my global total, or does it just power this ship? Like, does that save me having to construct my own uranium or my own reactor? Well, we need these. We need uranium. Oh, I can take everything at once. Good to know. Flower pot. Ooh. You know, I'm not sure I've uh, even paid attention to the fact that there's sometimes ladders. I may have missed some upper floors on some other build. That looks like some kind of a brain. Let's see. Different types of plants. Alright, well, we'll keep the downstairs under our. Right, the downstairs is done. Let's 
check it out and uh, come back again with an empty pocket. But no, I've there was that nearby ship anyway. There was uranium. Uh, well, it wasn't uranium. Right? There was a uh, whatever that reactor was, nuclear reactor thing. So I'll build a rod in a minute and see. Ooh, I got some. Definitely got some new flowers there. Um. If I build the rod and put it into one, I'll see does it add to my global total. If it does, it'll save me a lot of uh, construction because the resource requirements for those uranium rack actually wasn't much. Hmm. Well, I'll build the rod first anyway, and if I can't plug it into the reactor, I'll go ahead and build my own reactor. There's definitely, it's definitely weird that there's like no traces of anybody. It's like completely dead. Ooh. Now we're talking business. Bioplastic nugget. Like that was one of the best chests I've ever found. Um, rocket engine. Never even thought to look for them before. That's one that I don't have to build now towards the jetpack. I have a feeling that the contents of these chests aren't predetermined. That they'll they're randomly decided for you based on how far in the game you are. Because oh. <gasps> It. We've got two. That's enough to build uh, my jetpack. Well, I think there's some other bits needed too, but that was. Uh... Oh, wait. Did it just deconstruct the jet, the rocket engine? I see now. But no, rocket engine should be a, cons uh, a you know, carryable item. Could be doing a few laps back and forth from here. No, I kept them. Engine for rockets. That's good now again with the amount of uh, uranium. I know what the nugget does. I can come back later. If needs be. I don't want to... I'm going to take the good stuff and I'll come back later. I definitely want the uranium. That plant can go for the uranium. That's a fairly good, uh, that's a good haul. I think it was this direction. Well, I'll see if I have enough. To, I probably do have enough uranium, but it's pretty scattered through so many chests in different locations that it's probably not going to be ideal. Well, I'm going to have to go scavenge it all. But in the meantime, terraforming numbers are skyrocketing. Some really good textures. It's a bit inconsistent, but that looks really quite nice. I think the sand then is a bit bleh. Maybe it's just the lighting's not great or something. Right, back to the big base. Definitely going to turn on that reactor if I can. I want some in there. That should be an awful lot of power to do my... Any future endeavors. But let's see if I can make a jetpack quick. I hope the jetpack doesn't require fuel. If I have to constantly be stuffing cobalt or whatever it is into it. Just the one chunk of titanium. Oh wait, do you know what's now an issue? Is um I'm out of space. I need to build the advanced um backpack. Not the backpack, the next exoskeleton. Titanium is silicone. I 
I think I have titanium instead of one. What was it? Titanium, magnesium, silicone. It's gonna get awkward then too, because I have to only equip the one I have. So titanium. I'll take two just in case. There's silicone. She's someone's looking out for me today. Titanium again. I'll grab another bit of one or two bits. Inventory full. Oh well. That'll do. Back to the base. It's nice. There's a bit of color here. Once I get up to the second floor, I think. Once I have two floors in this place, it'll be looking very fancy. Right, this is going to cause a load of chaos for a brief minute. Because I'm going to have... Actually, I don't have enough room. Can I build the little uh, blueprint computer? I'll get rid of some junk. Area lamp. We got a good few bits there now. They all look nice. Okay. So I need to unequip my other one. Which, yes, caused some unwanted behavior. And now. Ooh. There we go. No, I'm missing a rocket. I wanted one piece of titanium. Wait, how do I use it? Doesn't appear to have a. I don't see an energy. Wow, game changer. Right, what's next? Bigger backpack. We could do that one now because I do have a few of the alloys. A three. The bigger backpack's a good one. Or I'm gonna pick out the uranium I have in these chests and put them all together. Makes this storm in the one. I need nine. Three, six, seven. Not quite, but sure. What else do I need for that backpack? That's all I need. Just gonna empty out everything else I can because the default backpack is small. I'm missing titanium. Oh, wrong one. But that would be good too. I need three more super allies, which I don't currently have. Nice. That's a big bag. Big bag of supplies. Well, then, do you know what? So I won't do it today. One, one that. Maybe I do have enough for the oxygen tank. It'll be a hell of a lot quicker for me to get back to places now with that jetpack, so... What I'm gonna do is... Get the mice too. Tier 3... So that's everything I can get even on. I'll make my way back to the other place, I'll get the uranium, I'll get any of these things... And that should be kind of enough to start the next phase of... Well, it's all the problem as to whether or not the uranium rods restart that thing. So yeah, that's a good start, no? And I might steal some computers and stuff from the other place. 
But there we go. That's it for today, you know. That's some serious progress. Talk to you tomorrow.